Welcome to Steve's World UK. Today we're in Bewley in Hampshire. So today, the Bewley National Motor Museum is part of my world. The museum was founded in 1952 by Edward Douglas Scott Montague, the third Baron Montague of Bewley, as a tribute to his father. So we have a map and guidebook to the museum. So come with me and let's take a look. So there is a monorail that does circulate around the museum, but unfortunately today it is closed for essential repairs. Maybe next time. So first up in this museum is the on-screen cars. The cars truly are the star in this ever-changing exhibition of TV and film favourites that do include Mr Bean's Lime Green Mini, Del Boy's Reliant Robin Van from the hit BBC comedy series Only Fools and Horses, the Jaguar XKR from the Bond film Die Another Day, the flying Ford Anglia from Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets, Doctor Who's much-loved car Bessie from the John Pertwee era and Barbara's pink taxi from the League of Gentlemen. Next is the world of Top Gear. Not before we check out the ice cream van and this Mr Whippy has had a 4x4 monster truck makeover and if the weather was better we'd certainly be up for this. This Mr. Nippy was in fact used in series 29, episode 5, back in 2020. Oh, 
So we're greeted at the entrance by the Fiat Panda limo, Series 9, Episode 2. This is the actual Fiat Panda limousine, as used by Jeremy Clarkson in the Top Gear stretched limo film. Just to the right, you can find the Ski Jumping Mini Series 7, Episode 7, back in 2006. Back in 2009, Series 14, Episode 3, this is the actual gondola used by James May for his caravan airship. And then a Reliant Robin space shuttle featured in 2007 when Top Gear was in Norway filming their Winter Olympic special. So let's go into the world of Top Gear and check out the rest of the exhibition. Welcome to the world of Top Gear at Bewley. It's like you can also have a tour on the veteran bus. Runs every 15 minutes. Plenty of refreshments on hand, including the Brabazon restaurant. So next, heading into the National Motor Museum itself. So in this hall, we're going to see a selection of vehicles representing the diversity of motoring from its beginnings to the modern day. So let's take a look and enjoy.
From the earliest motor carriages to classic family saloons, the world-famous National Motor Museum has one of the finest collections of cars, motorcycles and motor and memorabilia in the world. From legendary F1 cars and land speed record breakers for the speed freaks, to incredible examples of pioneering motoring for the history buffs, and if you time it right, you'll even hear vehicles starting up. With the oldest dating from 1875, the National Motor Museum Trust possesses a collection of over 285 vehicles. You can also browse the entire vehicle collection on the National Motor Museum Trust website. So sit back and relax and come with me as I take an entire look at the complete collection. Here at a checkered history, we're stepping into the adrenaline fueled world of motorsport. Grand Prix Great celebrates the history of F1, whilst road, race and rally focuses on sports cars from rallying hill climbing and the consumer market. From the early days of motorsports to urban culture, you can see motorcycles displayed with unique backdrops, each giving a hint to their cultural context in the motorcycle story.
The Mini 8 Span Orange may be the quirkiest vehicle in the National Motor Museum, but it wasn't built for speed. When it reaches over 30 miles per hour, it has a tendency to roll. In Jack Turner's garage, you have the opportunity of exploring a rustic 1930s garage, packed full of artifacts, fixtures, fittings, tools, and collections from a bygone era. And just next door for Britain and for the hell of it, you can indulge in the triumph of British land speed record attempts in an inspiring multimedia display. So that's going to do it for today. Thank you for joining me. Don't forget to like, subscribe and click that notification bell so you don't miss out on great future content from Steve's World UK. Until next time, be safe, be good, be kind and be careful. It takes 24 hours for the world to turn once but only 2 seconds to like or subscribe to see great future content from Steve's World UK.